Yes, I'm going to summarize in general this. Let us uh, go directly to part nine of introduction to managerial accounting. So enterprise risk management process used by a company to proactively identify the business risk that it faces and to develop responses to those risks that enable the company to be reasonably assured of satisfying stakeholders expectation. The stakeholders expectation, the stakeholders are the public, the capital, the capitalists of the company, they are not necessarily public, but if your company is publicly listed, so stakeholders are the public that owns some portion of the company. So risk management. So we have to manage the risk because if uh, the company suffers uh, losses due to risk, it is so much, no? so much. Companies should identify foreseeable risk before the occur. So we have again to list down all the possible potential risk that our company has. Once a risk has been identified, a company can respond in various ways, such as accepting, avoiding, sharing, or reducing the risk. So almost always reducing the risk, share the risk with other partners. So that's why we are partnering with other companies so that our risk should be shared. We can avoid it by totally, for example, closing a certain product line, okay? For example, if a company is manufacturing a refrigeration system, washing machine and air conditioning, so let us stop the operation for, for a washing machine. So we can avoid the risk of that business sector, okay? Accept. We should just accept that we are, but when you are accepting the higher risk, you have to be prepared what will happen later. So accepting, but meaning you are preparing. Okay. So example of business risk, intellectual asset being stolen from computer files. So we have to create firewalls that prohibit computer hackers from computing or stealing intellectual property. Products harming customers. Develop a formal and regular new product testing program. Losing market share. Number three, today enforcing action of competitors. So we formalize and approach for legally gathering information about competitors' plans and practices. Number four, proper weather condition, shutting down operation. Poor within weather condition. Develop contingency plans for overcoming any disruptions due to weather. So typhoon, okay, earthquake, fire, a website malfunctioning. Develop a pilot testing program before going live on the internet. So very uh, massive technology boom on online acceptance of businesses and companies to go into this type of uh, what, uh, function for the company's benefit. So number six, supplier strike halting the flow of raw materials. We have to be prepared, establish a relationship with two companies capable of providing needed not only one company, for example. Number seven, an incentive compensation system causing employees to make poor decision. Create a balanced set of performance measure that motivates the third behavior. Poor working attitude. So let us make a compensation package for good performance behavior. Number eight, financial. Uh, statements unfairly reporting the value of inventory. Okay, this is a bad or malpractice. No? Count the physical inventory on hand to make sure that it agrees with the accounting inventory. 
Number nine, an employee stealing asset. Segregate usage so that same employee does not have physical custody of an asset and the ability to account for it. So one for the physical and one for the recording. Different person, okay? An employee accessing an authorized information. So what is number 10? No? Create password protected barriers that prohibit employees from obtaining information that needed to do their job. Number 11, inaccurate budget estimate causing excessive or insufficient production. Okay, implement a rigorous budget review. Number 12, failing to comply with equal employment opportunity law. Create a report that tracks key metrics related to compliance with the law. Okay, let us continue to the next video, which would be the last and final introduction to this topic. Okay, again, this is Dr. Lippi, Preaching Engineering for Nation Building.